A protest last month where 20 stylists gave out free haircuts right here on the state capitol lawn has now resulted in seven of those stylists receiving formal charges. In a press conference here today at the state capitol in the same spot, we heard from the attorney representing six of those stylists, including Owasso barber Carl Mankey. Not only is there just are there criminal charges against our clients for supposedly, I guess, violating the governor's executive order, it's kind of unclear on the tickets, but they've charged them under the disorderly person statute, which says they were operating an illegal business or an illegal occupation. Well, the last time I checked, being a barber or a hairstylist, a cosmetologist is not an illegal occupation. One of those constitutional rights we all hold sacred is the right to disagree and the right to free speech in expressing those opinions. Hundreds of people showed up to Capitol to express their free speech, declaring it was time to move Michigan forward. Several barbers and stylists came to cut hair, and hundreds came to get their hair cut. They were saying it was time to stand up for Michigan. Our rights to freedom of speech, freedom to assemble, freedom to go against the government when they are being unlawful. Those are God-given rights. The governor's duty is to protect those rights. So again, as you heard, these stylists are not giving up without a fight. They say it's their right as American citizens. Coming up tonight at 6, I'll introduce you to a new petition these stylists say they hope will cause change. In Lansing, Ashland Hill, WNEM, TV5.